I think we have to try Elon Musk. Two stuns. There we go. I think we got it. For the past few weeks, a bunch of people on Reddit's Wall Street Bets nearly bankrupted several hedge funds by simultaneously buying GameStop stocks, sending the price soaring over 10,000%. It was the first time in history that a series of retail traders defeated a massive hedge fund. Now, several posts have popped up saying there'll be a movie about this. And while I can't make a movie, I can make a video game. Press start. We'll start by creating a new game with Unity and throwing a scene together with some characters. Now, one of my favorite games of all time is Paper Mario. And since the GameStop saga has a ton of adversaries, a turn-based combat system is perfect. Also, who doesn't love smashing like buttons with hammers? I started to add character movement using Dootween. And later, I created health bars on top of the characters. There's just one problem. I don't know how to make a 2D game. <laughs> Look at this. What is this garbage? Two hours later... After several hours of trying to figure out how the sprite renderers work, I began to create the combat system. I didn't have too much time to make this game, so I settled on four attacks. We have the basic attack, the AoE attack, the super awesome Elon Musk in a spacesuit rockets laser attack. Yeah, uh, I'll explain this one in a bit. And finally, the heal ability. But now I had another problem. The GameStop saga has all of these adversaries, but I don't have any 2D characters even remotely resembling them. So I recruited my brother to make 2D characters for the game. And dear god, these are absolutely ridiculous. Chris has really outdone himself here. Just look at this Robin Hood character. Hey, uh, that's looking kinda sus. He also created the protagonists for the game. Obviously, Reddit will be a character, and will give a special attack to Elon Musk, since one of his early tweets kickstarted the viral GameStop rise. Along with this, my brother created a character for the Reddit user, Deep... Uh, deep Value. Yeah, Deep Value, that's it. Who made over $33 million through this GameStop fiasco. With the characters complete, it's time to give them stats and create stages. I used scriptable objects to give enemies attack stats, which allowed me to easily drag and drop enemy stats in the Unity Editor. I wanted the stages to correspond to events that took place in real life, so I created stages with Robin Hood backstabbing Reddit, Citadel bailing out the shorting funds, and Jim Cramer trying to convince the Redditors to sell. Now, if you think I'm an idiot for making this, Yeah, the script looks right. What well, it's supposed to say, it's supposed to say genius. No, oh, the script's accurate. Now you probably think I'm a genius for making this, and the game is totally free. But I want to make the game actually fun to play. So I created weapons upgrades in an RPG-style level system. To make the boss fights more strategic and interesting, I used the scriptable objects from before to add percentage variables to determine what type of attack the enemy will use. For example, in real life, Citadel was the hedge fund that bailed out Melvin Capital, so I made the Citadel enemy have an 80% chance of using the heal spell. Now that I have all these stat systems in place, it should be easy to balance the game, right? Oh god, I was so wrong about this. Look at this. Water bottles everywhere, game, last boss that I can't beat, code, wings. Ah, uh, this was way too large of a project. With the game nearly complete, let's check out the stages and the real-life events that inspired them. December 2020, Reddit Wall Street Bets notices GameStop shorts. The Betrayal. Robinhood and nearly all other stockbrokers only allow selling of GameStop stock. Beware the fake accounts.
I did make up a few of the boss fights. Before I face the final boss, we need to add some epic music. Oh yeah, this is definitely a corruption street. This is it. This is the last boss music. Yes! I stunned the healer. I stunned the healer. Here we go. Here we go. Now I heal. Oh baby, I think we're gonna do it. There we go. I think we got it. I think we got it. Ah, he attacks too. Oh my god, he's too weak though. If we get one stun, we win. Come on, baby. Come on, Elon Musk. We need it. We need you, Elon Musk. Come on, baby. Yes! We stunned Melvin Capital. There we go. And for one last attack, Elon Musk did not let me down. Thank you so much for watching this video. Feel free to check out Reddit vs. Wall Street in the description below. See you in the next video.